Hello and welcome to another edition of the Historic College Football Playoff, this one for the 1985 college football season, so let's just hop into it. We will start things off in the Cotton Bowl as the number one Penn State Nittany Lions take on the number four Miami Hurricanes. And those Nittany Lions would get the scoring started in the first, as DJ Dozier would take this pitch outside, make a man miss, and push his way across the line for the score. Miami would respond though, as Alonzo Highsmith would find the end zone himself. Penn State would come right back though, and on third down, John Schaefer would take a shot and connect with Ray Roundtree for the score. Not to be outshone though, Vinny Testaverde would find Willie Smith to knock things up at 14. Heading into the half though, Penn State would kick this field goal to take a three point lead. Though Miami would retie the game, kicking this field goal to tie things up with the opening possession of the second half. Schaefer would counter though, throwing his second touchdown pass of the day, finding Michael Timpson deep for the score. The Nittany Lions would go on to add two more field goals later in the game and pull away with the 30-17 victory to advance to the national championship game. We now head to the bayous of Louisiana as the number two Oklahoma Sooners take on the number three Iowa Hawkeyes in the Sugar Bowl. After getting a stop on defense, Oklahoma would open up the scoring with this field goal. Iowa would rebound on their next drive though and Ronnie Harmon would find the end zone for six and the Hawkeye lead. Oklahoma would soon show they could score as well as Jamil Holloway would take this option keeper in for the score. Heisman finalist Chuck Long, though, would not be deterred, and he'd zip a pass to Scott Helverson for the Hawkeye score. The Sooners would respond, though, this time on the feet of Lydell Carr. Not long after, though, the Hawkeyes would retie the game with this field goal. The tie would not last, though, as Lydell Carr would receive this option pitch before spinning out of a tackle and then finding his way to the end zone. With that, the Sooners would come away with a 24-17 victory to advance the national championship game against the number one Penn State and a -Lines. Now before we head on to the national championship, if you're enjoying the video, please leave a like, and if you're enjoying the series as a whole and have not already, please consider subscribing, as well as ringing that notification bell so you're notified when the next release comes out. Now on to the national championship. We now head westward to Tempe, Arizona and the National Championship game in the Fiesta Bowl as the number one Penn State Nittany Lions take on the number two Oklahoma Sooners. Oklahoma would start the scoring in the first as Leon Perry would receive the option pitch out and go into the end zone untouched. Oklahoma would then get a stop on defense and expand their lead as Hollyway would take this option keeper and score himself. The lead would then just get bigger in the second as they'd kick this field goal. Penn State would then finally get on the board later in the second with a field goal of their own. Though they'd leave some time on the clock, and with time running down, Oklahoma would get into field goal range and add another one before the half. To start the third, though, Penn State would finally find the end zone, by way of Dazier. The Sooner offense would just be too much to overcome, though, and Hollyway would use his option pass and find Keith Jackson over the middle for yet another score. Though Penn State would add another Dazier touchdown, Oklahoma would add two field goals and pull out the 30-17 win to claim the national championship. Thank you all for watching. Again, if you have not already liked the video, subscribed, or rung that notification bell, please do so as it really helps the channel out. Additionally, since I'm using a tech sim, if you have a specific season you'd like to see, just leave it in the comments and I will hop right on it. Otherwise, I will just continue to go chronologically. Thanks again for watching. Bye.